guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. I am here today with a small haul from the 99 cent store. I just wanted to share it with you guys. If you have never been to our channel before, we are all about the food here. We do taste tests, what's for dinner, recipes, and grocery hauls. So let me jump in with this. I was so excited to see this popcorn. Now this is Boom Chicka Pop and this is the microwave popcorn. And what's cool about this is that it pops up in bowls. So I have tried the Skinny Pop and I really, really like it a lot. Skinny Pop also has a microwave version and you also pop it in bowls, which is very cool. Now, normally I don't like microwave popcorn because it has a bunch of chemicals in it, but Skinny Pop and this Boom Chicka does not. So let me show you what it has in it. This is it. Corn, palm oil, and sea salt. And if it's anything like the Skinny Pop microwave popcorn, I'm going to be psyched. So of course, this was only 99 cents and you get four fresh pop bowls. So I think that was probably my best and biggest score for today. So I got two boxes. And then they had the chicken Oscar Mayer hot dogs. And I have never seen these before. Um, I showed them to Howard and he said he's had them before. Maybe I've been living under a rock, I don't know. But I've never seen jumbo chicken hot dogs, so I was very excited to see them. And you guys know that I was recently introduced to these chow mein noodles and they are really very good. Now the problem is, is that they don't have all the flavors at all the stores. And I don't think I've ever seen this shrimp flavor before. So I wanted to try it. So I got two of them to try. I was also excited to see this Kikkoman stir fry sauce. And um, Kikkoman is very expensive, but I do really like Kikkoman a lot. I buy their soy sauce exclusively. So anytime I see one of their sauces in the 99 cent store, I always get their sauce. So I got that. I always need um, bouillon um, on hand. And this is the Nor. So I got one of those. And then my mom, um, who I've mentioned on my other videos, does not live here. She does not live near a 99 cent store at all. So she called me and asked me if I would pick up their flour. So she has been using their flowers for their flour for years. And whenever I go to the 99 cent store, if I know that I'm going home, I always ask her if she wants some. And so she called today and asked me if I could pick up some flour for her. She absolutely loves this flour. Um, and this is a two pound bag. And of course it was only 99 cents. She asked me to get her four bags and she swears by it. She says it is absolutely the best flour ever. She loves it, made in Utah. So I got her four bags. And then let me show you some of the non-grocery items. So this is a very large bottle of Purell Healthy Soap. Now I've never actually seen their soap before. Of course I always get their hand sanitizer, but these are really large bottles, 12 ounces. I got two of them and I got them because I am running low on my Bath & Body Works soap. So whenever Bath & Body Works has a sale, I always try to stock up and I'm actually almost at the end of my stash. So I decided to grab two of these. And then I was really excited to see this, Eco Tools. Now, normally I don't buy um, any like perfumes or, or lotions or anything like that from the 99 cent store. But this caught my attention because it says it's from nature. And I'll turn it over on the back. Maybe you guys can see. 98% from nature, hypoallergenic, paraben free. And then when you look at the ingredients, it has all natural stuff in there. See, um, honeysuckle, um, all sorts of stuff. It's kind of hard to read it in film, but it has all sorts of stuff here. And they had two different scents. They had this one and this scent is, let's see, here it is. It says peony, it has the scent of peony and uh, fresh 
picked flowers. And then they had another one that was a citrus scent. Now, normally I am a citrus scent person. I love um, grapefruit and lemon and lime and stuff like that. I did not like the smell of that um, citrus scent. I really preferred this smell, the floral smell. And what it smells like is kind of like, um, like a tropical flower, like something you would smell in Hawaii. It's very, um, floral and I really like it. It smells really good. So I got one bottle and then I also got some cedar hang ups and these were 99 cent too. You get two of them and these are from my closet and this is, that's what they look like right in there. So I got two of them. And then the last thing that I got are these bandanas. I got one in the white and black and then I got a gray one. Now let me flip it over and show you. It's not like a regular bandana. It's actually very stretchy. It's very, very stretchy. And these are all the different ways that you can wear the bandana. So I'm very excited about that. All the different ways you can wear it. And like I said, it's very stretchy and it feels really, really good. Um, I'm gonna wear it out, of course, but then I also thought I can wear it in at night because I think, I have to double check, I think this might be cotton, not sure. But anyway, so this is it. This is my very, very small haul. Like I said, I just wanted to share it with you guys. I hope you liked it. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, I hope that you will subscribe to our channel. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.